All right, it's Wednesday, June 5th. We're already five days into June. Uh, over Memorial Day weekend, Middle of Beyond had a 20% off sale, and I thought, great, uh, perfect opportunity to repurchase uh, a few shirts I want because I'm obviously not wearing the 2XL anymore, so I had to buy larges because um, otherwise I'm just floating around there like little moves on me basically so uh, here's my order gonna show off what I rebought and then gonna try to <laughs> sell the old ones and hopefully recoup a little bit from that so it's not not really too bad of an upgrade so let's show you these shirts that I repurchased uh, this one was actually kind of a good repurchase because I got this way, way back in the day um, when they first started doing button-ups and the quality was not the best and it faded pretty quickly, uh, but I had to get the first Evil Dead uh, button-up. It is a great looking one and I just needed it. And then the next one, I ordered the uh, Killer Clowns one right there just because it's a great shirt. And it's Killer Clowns, so I reordered that one. And because I wear the ever-living hell out of that pumpkin head one, I reordered that one as well. Um, it just, it's such a great shirt and it goes great with the pumpkin head hat that I got it from Inked Up Merch, which um, again, if you want really great horror hats, definitely go check them out. And uh, this one I'm gonna re, I had to rebuy because I bought it and within one wash, all the buttons actually fell off. So it lasted one wear, so that was really disappointing. So. Hopefully, uh, the buttons actually last on this one, I hope. Uh, but that's a really great trick-or-treat shirt. Um, let me know if you guys hit up that sale and picked up anything uh, from it. Um, I'm just really excited about this shirt because I, I literally got to wear it once to Crypticon last year and uh, the buttons kept like popping off of it, so that was really a big, sloppy, unfun mess. Um, and I wasn't very happy about it, but I just, you know, I probably should have emailed him and said, Hey, I, uh, the buttons came off this thing, but I, I just didn't take care of it. So that's my fault. So, um, but yeah, I am wearing the Suspiria one from the last video right there. It fits really great. Um, the flannel I probably should not wear because it's supposed to be like 80 or 80, 90 degrees over the next few days. So a flannel <laughs> and that kind of weather is not good. It's not smart. Maybe if I was going to the coast or something like that. That would be maybe good, but we'll see. A coast trip this summer would be good for me. I, I need to have a break and get out of the town. <laughs> anyway, um, Today for activities though, just to kind of get a little more than just me showing, hey, here's four shirts, okay, bye, done. Um, I am going to probably head over to Bridgeport and get some lunch, go visit a friend, get some coffee. Um, and then I think I'm gonna try to hit Walmart to get that fifth and final uh, Bones coffee one that I didn't get, which was the Holy Cannoli. Um, and Valley Village to see if there is anything cool out there and Target and I think I think that's gonna be my day I'm also gonna try to go to Joann's because apparently I've been hearing rumors that uh, Halloween is actually uh, Popping up right now. It's not that uh, Kind of witchy spring stuff they put in a few weeks ago, but actual legitimate Halloween. So we'll see about that um, But yeah, that's what I have for you right now And then hopefully I can bust out a video of my adventuring today and we'll see what happens. Anyway, thanks for watching the video, and if you like my videos, I don't know, give me a subscribe or something. Anyway, that's it. Talk to you later. Bye-bye.